when you activate this vitality and intelligence in the body, it can help you to fix any damaged tissues, can balance your energy in the body. And so once the energy in the body balance, the body heals. We believe the most powerful healing energy in the entire universe is unconditional love. It's universal unconditional love. And so our vision is a healer in every home, in a world without pain and suffering. Our goal is very clear. This is what we want to do. And most of the Qigong forms do not have that. And then the other thing is, and our Qigong forms is very simple. And I combine the emotions, the wisdom and the power, the healing power of, of emotions together with the movement. And this is almost the first time in the Qigong society that emotion, Qigong movement and meditation combine together as one. So that's why it is more powerful. And then also we not only teach people how to do this movement to balance the energy for their own body, we also teach people how to send out energy to help to help their loved ones. And we call it the external Qigong. And many Qigong forms do not have that, and we do. What I'm telling you is the Qi has an intelligence. It connects you to the divine energy. It connects to a much deeper source to help you to activate that power to fix the damaged tissues. Like Esther Choiho with the oxygen tank for six and a half years. How could the lung scar tissues, lung scar tissues disappear within eight weeks of practice of Qigong? Because she, through that practice, she woke up the intelligence in the body, the consciousness of the body, connect to the origin information. Now we do, we do, nowadays we're talking about stem cell, right? You connect back to the origin inform, information and re-download the information to clear the blockages. I want you to put up your shorter hand and put that hand down. If your hands, uh, the fingers are the same length, they put up either your hand will do. And put that hand down on the left, right? So now I want you to focus on your heart. Put a smile on your face and then say in your mind, my fingers are growing longer, 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 longer. I really feel from my heart, my fingers are growing longer, 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 longer. I really feel my fingers are growing longer, 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 longer. All right, now open your eyes, compare your hands. Cool, huh? All right, now shake your hands a little bit and say, my fingers go back to normal, and then compare, compare your hands. All right, cool, huh? Give yourself a plus. That's the power of your heart. That's the power of your mind. The mind belongs to the heart. The mind is only part of the heart. Now I want you to do, uh, repeat this experiment. And, but this time I want you to activate your heart energy to make it longer, faster. Right, just now I gave you like a, 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 a 30 seconds or one minute maybe and, uh, to make your fingers grow that long. So this time you know which hand your fingers is short, all right? It's shorter than the other hand. So I want you to focus on your heart. Just for the second. Feel that warmth in your heart. And put a smile on your face. Smiles. Uh, stands for start my internal love engine so you start your love engine and then you just talk in your mind say i want my fingers grow longer now put your hand up and compare your hands (laughs) 
Isn't that cool? It's only two seconds. Hey, listen to this. Two seconds, you are able to grow your fingers that much. Yeah, <laughs> you bet. Yeah, <laughs> you do it with your toes.、Right? Um, if you got a blockage in the body here and there, you talk in your mind. You activate the chi from your heart. You feel the moment. You bless your body in that way. You see? Can you shrink the tumor? Of course. Can you transform that lung scar tissues? Of course. This demonstration is about the power of your mind. This is a demonstration you can enjoy with your friends. It is also a powerful healing technique. Sit up straight. Place your hands on your lap, facing down. Then turn your head slowly to the left, and see how far you can comfortably turn your neck. And notice specifically how far around to the left you can see. Make note of that. Feel how tight or how relaxed your muscles feel. Make note of that too. Then return your head to the center and start turning to the right as far as you can. Once again, see how relaxed or tight the muscles are, and see how far around to the right you can turn your head, and how far around to the right you can see. Again, make note of these things. One side will probably have felt more relaxed. You could turn your head farther to that side, see farther. This happens to just about everyone every day. One side becomes tighter than the other. So here is the energy technique: how you tapped into the power of your mind. Focus on the side that was better, the side that felt more relaxed, the side where you could turn your head farther. And see more to that side. Here, I'm going to share with you a technique you can help yourself or help others to heal stroke. What you do is you always start from the left hand because in that way you can help to activate the healing energy much faster and more completely. So you use your fingernail to press the tip of the middle finger first. Press it deep. Until you or your friends or anyone to feel a pressure or pain, that's the best. For three seconds, and then you let go, and then do the index finger in the same way. Press the tip of the fingers down with the fingernail, and until you feel pain, and then let go, and then do the ring finger, the tip of the fingers, until you feel the pressure, the pain. And then let go, and then do the thumb, the same way. Then the little finger, the same way. Three seconds, three seconds. Start from the middle finger, the index finger, the ring finger, the thumb, and then the little finger. When you finish the left hand, and you do the right hand. If you can do the toes in this way too, that's even better.